So my email yesterday about Fatty15 created a little bit of upset. I had some responses that it wasn't vegan, it wasn't um, backed by science, and then some really great questions came in as well. So I wanted to clear some confusion and bring some information to light for you. First of all, what is Fatty15? I just heard about this a couple of months ago. I've been taking it for six weeks about, I'm very impressed with it. It is the first essential fatty acid. This is what it looks like. It's in pill form, discovered in 90 years. And it is shown, this has been shown by science to be three times broader, safer, and more effective than omega-3s. So most of us are taking some supplemental omega-3, DHA, EPA. I was taking it in oil form. I hated it or even in capsule, which I didn't feel like was absorbing as well, but I just hated taking the oil, even though I knew I had to take it. And my doctor was recommending I take more now that I'm menopausal. This is replacing it. And it's so much easier to take. And after six weeks, I'm already noticing benefits. I'm going to start taking two a day and just notice how that might shift for me. I'm noticing my energy is better. I'm sleeping more deeply. I'm not waking as much at night. Um, and there's a lot of other health benefits beyond sort of the more obvious short term. This works on a cellular level with mitochondrial function and makes our cells healthier. Red blood cells strengthens them. It makes our liver healthier long term. It's also um, helping with premature aging. So with reversing the cell aging in our bodies. Uh, you can look up a lot of information on their site. It is science-backed and it is vegan. So where would we get this if we're not getting it here? Well, some lovely sources include whole milk products, whole fat milk products, and fish, but mostly the skin and heads of fish. Also brown algae, which I'm going to look into, but let's talk about milk and fish for a moment. For those of us who eat fish, I don't, but if you do, it's probably unlikely that you're eating a lot of the skin and the heads of fish. Very few people are consuming whole fat milk products. And if you do, you're probably not consuming enough of it to get the quantities you need because it is in smaller quantities and you will get some, but with the expense of having all of the cal calories, it's very calorically dense, and also other health issues that arise from consuming dairy. So. This is a reliable and effective way to get your C15, is the essential fatty acid. This is called fatty 15, but if you look on their site and look into it, it's called C15. You can get your blood tested for C15 levels to see if you're deficient. So you would have to ask for that specific panel and there's information on their site about that. So I share this with you. And if you have any other questions, of course, reach out to me. Um, take it or leave it. If you want to take it, great. If you don't, great. If you do and you want more information, comment 15 and I'll send the link and discount code your way. Uh, you know, as we age, we need a little more support in our bodies for the demands of our lives and just because of the aging of our cells. I feel this is giving me support, so this is why I share it with you. I only share things with you that I use and love myself. Okay, so take it or leave it. I hope that is helpful. Any other questions, reach out to me. Thank you for watching, for being here. I send you love and gratitude and we'll be back with more soon. See you.